we have some new information here in regards to Jupiter. We have a Kimberly Moore of Harvard University announcing new results from the Juno mission. And they're saying that they find that Jupiter's magnetic field is different from all other known planetary magnetic fields. This is what they just put in this new paper. They're saying the best way to appreciate the strangeness of Jupiter's magnetic field is by comparison to Earth. Our planet has two well-defined poles, a north and a south. And right now, they're saying, if you look at this image, the north here would be this kind of smudged and smeared, smeared is the word that they use, widened area. And then there's a well-defined south pole that's very near the axis on where it rotates. And then right here is this blue spot. So you have this great blue spot, as they've dubbed it, in the magnetic field. And this is the new finding. So it's saying that there's three poles. There's three magnetic poles on this planet and this one situated not at the equator but kind of close to it so you can see the physical great red spot on Jupiter through a telescope now they're saying you know magnetically in the magnetic field looking at it this way there is a great blue spot and that is a very unique feature now, there is another possibility here, and it's that the planet's going through a pole reversal. When, when this planet, if you look at the models, and they go into motion, when it goes through a pole reversal, it, would, it looks something like this, where these crazy pole positions start popping up all over the place until they find a stable position. And... That's what happens sometimes in a pole reversal. But as of right now, they're stating that they believe this is the normal process of this planet. So, interesting. I'm going to look into this more. I'm going to expand on this. Underground World News Live, 8 p.m. Eastern, Dabu 77. Hope to see you guys there. Thursday, 7.45 Mountain Time. 